Kate Staley for Sundance Channel, and we're here in the Honda Power of Dreams studio. I am joined by the director and two of the stars of Motherhood. This is Catherine Diekman, Uma Thurman, and Anthony Edwards. Thank you guys for being here. Thanks Pleasure. for having us. So, Catherine, mm -hmm. what happens in this one day in the life of Eliza, played by Uma? Many, many things. In this one day, she has to throw her daughter's birthday party by the end of the day, and she also discovers at the beginning of the day she's a mom blogger, and she discovers she can... And, uh, enter a parenting contest, and she just has to write 500 words about what motherhood means to her, and that's sort Simple. of the challenge that faces her during the day. Um, among many, I mean, it's a day full of challenges. Are you so hard up for something to say that you have to use one of your closest friends' most personal and private experiences just to make yourself seem more clever and insightful? Oh, Christ, Sheila, I didn't mean to. I was yeah, but you I did. It doesn't matter, Eliza. Oh, God, well, I thought other single moms would relate. Oh, so wait, now I'm your token single mom. No, 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 other moms too, okay? Married moms. I mean, they can be sympathetic. Oh, they can feel sorry for me too. Well, that's great. So everybody can feel sorry for me. I don't want anyone to feel sorry for me. I'm a grown-up. I made a grown-up choice. And by the way, married women don't have a whole lot of sex either, and you should bloody know. Um, um why did you want to do this part? Um... It's just, it's just the kind of writing about life now and about something true um, and something kind of unexplored yet in our own backyard, motherhood. Um, Anthony, you're, you're a father of four, right? I am. So yeah. you're kind of busy. Well, I certainly have a respect for motherhood in that world. And, and I think Uma touched on something, which is what, why we're all here, which is that Catherine was actually able to capture something that's really difficult, which is mm -hmm. if you have 24 hours, how do you capture something that really reflects what the life of a family and the plight and the woes and, and challenges of a mother is. The mother is so often in films portrayed in a black and white fashion. You know, the good, the good mothers are in their J. Crew and driving their station wagons and it's selfless all... Selfless and... And, and, and they always selfless. do the right thing and they always say the right thing. And um, what I loved and what Catherine wrote is that this woman is like you or me. This is a real person. Who is who is complicated and good and Flawed and who and, and who cares about being a mother tremendously, but that's not it. That's not all, and yet that's everything. It was great when we were recording the score for the movie. One of the musicians, this great guitarist, Mark Rebo, said he was just seeing little bits of the movie as we laid down the the, the music, you know, and he said, you know. Diekman, I really, I think this is going to be good because, you know, on the one hand, you've got, like, best thing I've ever done, and on the other hand, you've got, like, strap them in the SUV and push the car in the lake, you know? And it's true. There's not much in between that. I was really impressed with the fact that Uma and, and Catherine really did maintain their priorities as to what the pro where, where the film really needed to live. And, you know, Uma had to do every single scene every day, and, uh, you know, her focus and, and diligence is really was really, you know, matched only by Catherine. So, I mean, it was a really wonderful kind of pairing to watch. Thank you guys for being here. Sure, Catherine, thanks. Uma, Anthony, congratulations, good luck. Thank you. Break thanks. a leg, is that what you're supposed hope to say to filmmakers? I hope you're coming. I hope I'm coming, too. Anybody got a ticket for me? <laughs> I, guess we'll you're the, I guess you're the person to ask. We'll um, I wish. They're, all, they're gone, but that's a good thing. That is a good thing. Yeah. For more information about motherhood and all the films at Sundance, please go to SundanceChannel.com.